Hey, what's up guys? So today is uh, day three of recovery. So the other day I hurt my back snowboarding with Chris. I got really excited um, on my first run and I was riding too hard and I just twisted funny. So I've been uh, recovering, starting to feel pretty, pretty good today. I think I'll be good to go riding again, maybe tomorrow or the next day. And yeah, for today, Chris has been editing videos like mad. Chris, what are you working on today? Uh, I'm putting up a couple videos for Patreon. So we got No Kevin, No Problem Day. What's that? That's our amazing day without you. <laughs> Yesterday? It was awesome. Yeah, it was really good. I'm also putting up weird outtakes. Too weird for YouTube, volume two on Patreon. Cool. So that'll be up by now. It'll be up by now. Yeah. A few things we need to do today. Make breakfast. Get those Patreon videos up. Maybe do a little stretch to get my back feeling good. What else? Shovel the driveway. <laughs> Chris is gonna shovel the driveway. Maybe a Q&A. Maybe some shopping. Maybe some food. <laughs> Maybe some food. Uh, Maybe we'll get some food today. Oh yes. This should be enough. Uh, Chris, how many bananas do you want? All of them. He says, drink eight bananas. Don't even think about it. Just drink those bananas. All right, see you in a bit, Chris. So basically what happened with my back is the other day I was going up, it was my first run of the day and I didn't take my own advice. I didn't warm up and I was just so excited to be up snowboarding and I was in a really good mood and I was riding really hard my first run and doing some uh, big jumps and then the next thing you know I just felt kind of like this like sharp pain like a lightning bolt come up the side of my back and just twisted funny so I went to the chiropractor she helped me out quite a bit but it's still pretty sore and I, I can't ride yet so I'm gonna go again today and then hopefully I'll be good for this weekend because it's Puking and Whistler. Let's go. Whew. Chiropractor is really painful. Just left, but hopefully it gets me straightened out so I can get back to snowboarding soon. Woo! Cool, so we found Chris, and Chris needs to buy some new boots. That's not right. Yeah, my foot just feels like it's it's swimming around in there. There's so much extra space. The ankle's moving, you can shift your foot around while it's in there. Look at the size of them snowflakes. It's like a parachuting panda bear. Put in our pizza order. Now we're gonna go look, see if Chris can find some boots. That are the ions. Take a bit to do up. Yeah, still going. Oh, cool. Hey, Chris got new boots. Woohoo! Yeah, size 11. 
<laughs> oh, what kind of boots you get there? Pineapple boots. Mmm, I love pineapple boots. With green pepper, laces. Oh, wait. Uh, wrong hand! I got a pizza too. Okay. Boa, baby! Photon. Yeah, my first boa. It looked good, I'm kind of jealous. Yeah, it's some space age crazy stuff going on. And you weren't going to buy the ions. I, de <laughs> I decided. I like the ions, I used to own the ions. But I can't wear Kevin's new gear and his old gear. <laughs> it's gonna be one or the other. Burn, but photon, baby. Let's go eat some pizza. <laughs> the customer service is pretty good too. Yeah, both places. It's really cool going into a shop and then you like can learn so much from the person that works there. Can you hold this? The pizza? Yeah. And shout out to Missy Mountain Pizza, the best pizza in Whistler. <laughs> Look at them. Glorious. Wow. So you lock it? Oh. Tighten the wheel. Cool. So it'd be great to hear from you guys and to see which lacing system you have and what are some of the pros and cons that you find with the boots that you have. So that'd be really cool to read about that down in the comments. Hope you guys are having fun riding. Hopefully I'll get back to riding soon and we'll see you guys in the next video pretty soon. Later Chris! <laughs> See you guys.